What's good, guys? It's Chad here from uh, Near Foundation. I'm with Emiliano from Rise. He is doing some vertical farming, if you haven't seen it. Basically doing plants, some really cool stuff with plants and ownership of plants. So uh, Emiliano, could you please explain to the people out here who you are and like your title? Of course. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, Chad. So Emiliano, co-founder and CEO of uh, Raiz Vertical Farms. So what we're building is uh, the centralized network of vertical farms to empower a more sustainable way to grow food and to feed the people in a more sustainable manner powered by blockchain. So it's a refi project that allows people to have a wider ownership and traceability of what they are consuming. Yeah. How can people get into the ownership? Can they get like an NFT and then they get like partial ownership into it? Um, how, how can they go about? Yeah, so at the moment they can't get NFTs through our mint based store, but we're developing a fungible token like to allow people to have two things, uh, ownership, but also yield coming from the tokens that they are holding, right? So in the future, we aim to have a decentralized food system where people can invest, yield uh, profit sharing, but also have a, a very tangible impact of what the tokens they are holding in terms of CO2, water, and miles. Okay. So when they buy this NFT, they'll get like a yield back, but uh, could you explain further of what it means to like buy into like rice or to like get an NFT or uh, something? Yes, I mean, let's focus on the on the token that's coming up. It's planned for next year, maybe in a year or so. So we're building a let's, let's let's go. Go. Uh, we're building this protocol that allows token holders to one finance the deployment of new farms. Right. So let's say you are interested in, of course, making a yield, but also having an impact. Right. So you can finance the deployment of new farms to these tokens wow. by staking them. You get access to a revenue flow. From the, from the profits generated by the farms, such as that one, that is being launched. Uh, we're having also a side event today. beautiful, dude. Thank you, thank you. So we aim to have hundreds or thousands of farms distributed. So as a token holder, you will not only get profits from one farm, but from the whole farm network. So every ecosystem partner, like be it an investor, an operator of a farm, or us as Raiz, we're incentivized to grow the farm network because the token price will appreciate also potentially the profits that you accrue from that while making a solid impact on the environment. Yeah, great. And you guys are based here in Lisbon, Portugal, right? Yeah. How, how's the operations and everything uh, going here? Are you doing stuff at like the Arroz Studios? Um, like what, what's been going down here, here in Lisbon? Yeah, so we launched our farm at Arroz Studios. Uh, it's two, long, two months old, so pretty fresh. Pretty fresh, no pun intended. Uh, I had fresh crops going out there, plenty of events. Um, we're increasingly getting requests like from corporate partners to attend, like to launch their own farm. So it's like pretty busy days. Um, yeah, just lots of fun. Looking forward to expanding uh, here in Portugal, but also in other parts of Europe, the US, and hopefully you'll be seeing more and more farms in the following years. Man. So exciting, dude. Like, I, as soon as I heard about your project, I wanted to get into rice farms, like, immediately. I, like, I would love to have this in my backyard of some sort. Like, is there, what, what would we be looking at maybe for, like, a timeline of, say, if someone wants to do this, like, at home or in their backyard or for their community, what is kind of, like, a roadmap of that look like? I would say, yeah, focusing on the community angle, right? So we want to have a critical mass of people to feed. Um, and in terms of roadmap, so we have next year, early next year, at least launching a couple of more farms. Nice. Afterwards, launching the token protocol. So that will allow us to launch, yeah, dozens of farms for communities, like finance farms for communities that need it the most. Nice. So I would say, yeah, end of next year or 2024, uh, already empowering communities to launch their own farms, more traceable, more sustainable, and just like be able to grow in their own food. That's where it's at, man. What's like your favorite thing that you're growing at Rice Farms? Like, what's the what, what's your favorite thing? And and is is the is it tasty? Is, yeah. Are things tasty? It's pretty damn tasty. <laughs> uh, I will have to say, dill. Oh, it's it, dill. It, it's, uh, it's our new star. It's 
<laughs> it's the real deal. <laughs> it's um, yeah, we started with basil, so basil it's uh, an all-time favorite, but but dill is like very unique and not a lot of people can find it, so okay, yeah. I think that's uh, something pretty special. Nice. Is that is it pretty easy to grow too the dill or is it like it's pretty difficult? Yeah. yeah. That's actually why we started growing it because there was people uh, restaurants, people saying that, hey, we can't find deal. So we took that challenge and we could grow it successfully. Let's go, so, dude. yeah, Let's go. <laughs> that's uh, also what we're looking for now, like high value crops, specialty crops, and eventually more and more high protein crops that are very nutritious for communities. Yeah. Well, Emiliano, is there anything you would like to say to the near community, to the people? We appreciate your time. And uh, yeah, is there anything else you'd like to say, man? No, just keep racing, keep racing uh, to anyone out there. I think just, uh, of course, support us in our different channels. We're, we're a young startup, but we're growing. And I think it's, it's all about community. So be it uh, token launch next year, fundraising this year, or any kind of partnerships or any kind of uh, people that want to launch their own, their own farms, don't hesitate to shoot us a message. And uh, we'll be happy to, to deploy more farms with the community. Hey, and once again, how can people get involved? How can they find it? They can go to like uh, the website. Yeah. They can buy an go NFT. To, go to to our Twitter account. It's uh, Raise Farms. R A I Z. R A I Z Farms. Uh, also to our yeah different channels, either LinkedIn, uh, Twitter, Instagram, or website. Perfect. And we'll be happy to accommodate any requests. And uh, yeah, just let's go. Let's do it. Sweet. Thank you for your time, man. I appreciate you.